All right, people, so I just took out my crochet braids after having it in for, um, since March 10th. Today is now April 2nd. Um, I am not a person, I'm used to combing my hair every day. So even when I had braids, the last time I had braids was, oh God, probably over a decade ago. Um, I have issues with that, but um, yeah, I don't normally keep them in for like two months. You won't see that, a month and a little bit. Um, so I was getting kind of antsy. I had the twists and I actually untwisted them. I'll show a uh, picture. I think I already showed pictures of it. Um, untwisted them as you can see, as you have seen. Um, and it came out big and I just got really antsy and plus the front wasn't working well and whatnot. So I just said, you know what? I'm ready to take this thing out. Um, so... I am pleasantly surprised. I do have neck issues. So I was concerned about the heaviness of the crochet braids. Um, it did get a little bit heavy. I think it was only because of the twist itself. Um, but for the most part, it was, um, it was okay. Yeah, but the other thing was my hair does get brittle. So when I take, usually when I take out the braids, my hair is coming out with it. I do have a little bit of strands of hair that is coming out. Um, I don't know if you can see that just a little bit yeah you can see that normally it's more clumpier than that so I was a bit concerned about that because I haven't been taking care of my hair lately um, so when I went and bought hair at the hair store I said you know what I need something a leave-in a good leave-in conditioner and I bought this and I washed my hair and I put this leave-in conditioner um, you can see it there right very good. I only use a little bit, make sure, condition my hair and whatnot. And so it was March 10th, I told you, when I put in the braids and I took it out today, April 2nd. I have a clump here. Ugh. Um, April 2nd. And when I was taking out my braids, I'm like, hmm, what's that smell? My goodness, my hair smells so sweet. My hair smells so sweet. Oh my gosh, my hair smells so sweet because of this. Okay, that. It smells so sweet. And also it feels moisturized because I didn't want it to be brittle or anything like that. It's, my hair is, I mean, everybody tells me my hair is soft. I mean, I'm just used to my hair, but it just feels extra soft. And I will definitely do crochet braids again. I had somebody do it for me. Um, but this time, I'm going to do it myself. I've been watching enough YouTube videos. Um, I'm going to do probably a part right here and a part right there so I can easily flip it. I did buy the hair with Model Model Glance. It is Italian Curl. So I'm excited to see what that looks like. I was going to go for a blonde, but I'm going to try that until next time. I even my hair. And I was like, you know what? Forget weed. Forget all that stuff. So when crochet braids came into being, oh my God. It was heaven sent because I can keep my natural hair and you know put in curly hair give my own hair a break this is a god don't trust me ah, as they say anyways um, yeah so anybody want to try crochet braids definitely try it um, it feels so good for the braids to be out of my hair though that I can go like this on my scalp because I, again, I say I'm so used to doing that. I'm so used to doing my hair in different, different ways. Um, so yeah, next, probably next Easter weekend is when I'm going to put in um, the Italian curl. Model, model glance. And it's cheap because they say it's going out of, it's going out of stock or it's um, discontinued. So I'm going to try and buy out more, but I hear that there's a residue on it. So definitely I'm going to do a, a, not tutorial, but a review on it because I hear there's a residue on the um, Mono Mono, the Italian curl. Um, but it looks so good. It has a wet look, but it's far from wet. Anyways, just wanted to share this <laughs> and my experience with crochet braids and um how it's making my hair feel nice and soft and smelling so good even though it's been in for like three something weeks that's pretty darn good you know we black people don't have to wash our hair every week or every two weeks you know what i mean so yeah and i haven't i haven't washed my hair since that day since march 9th the day before 
I haven't washed my hair since then. Actually, no, March 10th. I washed my hair that day because I don't go to work. So I washed my hair that day, March 10th. And that's not April 2nd. Yeah. Yeah. So definitely gonna wash it tomorrow though. Anyways, y'all, have a blessed day. Thank you for your time.